Hey guys, hi. Okay, I'm here to show you a small video on how you can use the rare and exotic uh, collection. So right now I have the five colors. I have a brush and I have a kajal pencil, any uh, kajal pencil. You can use a brown, you can use a black, whatever you want. So uh, what I'm going to start with is wearing the eyeshadow base. You just have to take a very small quantity. It is quite hard, so it makes, sh it makes sure that your eyeshadow does not crease so what you need to do is wear very little bit of it just enough for the eyeshadow to stick on you don't want to be wearing too much of it because the eyeshadow will crease so just a little bit of it so it has slight tint in it just so that the eyeshadow pops beautiful pink I love this oh yeah my nails were done at uh, Hyderabad when I was there this is by nail culture you can, I think you can use your fingers only the thing is I don't want to make it too difficult for you just tap the product you have enough of it on your hand and what you want to do is start in the middle and work outwards with any product including your lipstick you want to always start in the middle and work outwards a little more always take a little bit and add more if you want so I've just literally taken only that much start in the middle again if you want more intensity I'm gonna add a little bit now the gold dust is a little more fluid so I'm gonna take very little this is actually too much yeah I'm gonna tap into your finger or into your brush you're gonna get spill over spill over so I'm just going to flick. When I flick, the extra dust will come off. Don't put a lot in the beginning. And very close to the lash line, I'm just going to fill in that spot there. I'm going to take Plumeria. So I'm taking again very little bit of plumeria. Using the same finger again, it's, it's the ring finger, it gives the least amount of pressure. And just on the inner corner of your eyelid, just to highlight that look. You can see how it gives a lovely three tone eyeshadow, right? So you start with a lighter tone, it goes into a gold and you have a pinkish gold in the corner. Now say you want to make the pink a little more intense, take it away from, so take a little bit. Now I'm going to use a different finger. Yeah, I'm just going to use my index finger. So it has a beautiful 3D effect. And it's as simple as that. Now the thing is, if you want to, I'm gonna wipe that off. If you wanna add a little bit of uh, hydrangea. I love hydrangea. Where's hydrangea? It is, it looks, it doesn't do justice. The camera doesn't do justice to the kind of color it is, yeah. But it, it's a beautiful copper gold. But the thing is, the camera doesn't show the copper gold. It looks white over here. So I'm gonna take a little bit of hydrangea little more because I like it so much index finger and highlight can you see that absolutely love that now hydrangea can also be used as a highlight for the cheek so I'm just going to use my brush this is hydrangea here take a little bit of it just on the tip and highlight again camera just doesn't do justice to what it's doing to my skin it's a beautiful beautiful copper gold can you see what it's doing I don't know if it can be seen again with my brush and sweep it's 
so you can see the kind of effect that I've got on my cheek it's got a beautiful pink golden shine so I'm just using only these five colors I'm gonna take my kajal pencil use anything it doesn't matter now when you want to draw an eyeliner what you want to do is gently now I see a lot of people pulling the eye like this don't pull the eye like this what you want to do, gently stretch the eyelid and just above the eyelash line go up and down so when you come to the inner corner can you see both my eyes are open and I have the mirror right in front of me both my eyes are open and I'm just going on the lash line so up and down on the lash line you'll get a really nice line and I like to smudge it out with my finger itself I'm a finger kind of makeup person but for my clients I have to use a brush and there we have it yeah. you get this eyelash curler in uh, it's from Japanesque I picked up mine from Japanesque but I also saw this in this place on Brigade Road in Bangalore uh, in this place called Ilayu. so they had the same thing so you can pick it up there I think it was around 300 rupees so it's very easy for self uh, curling the lashes so you just put your lashes in there I give it about 12 pumps then I move it a little forward and I give it another 12 pumps Thanks guys, if you have any questions, you can write to me, uh, send me a DM, uh, I will eventually respond. Uh, there, are, there are quite a few DMs that come every day. So I take out time in the evening normally to respond to it. So any questions, anything more you want to know, anything um, new or exclusive you want me to release or make, please write to us. If it's feasible, yes, we will do. Okay, thank you.